Yoda guy here. Uh, today we are doing a brake upgrade on this here 2006 Toyota Sequoia. Now this Sequoia comes with 13 WL calipers, which are, you know, they're decent sized rotors and calipers. But little known fact about these trucks is that you can do a pretty simple, nearly almost bolt on upgrade and that's going to the GX460 brake calipers. You take brake calipers and rotors and pads from a Lexus GX460, also known as a Prado brake upgrade, also fifth gen forerunners. They all use the same components. Now what we're gonna be doing is, or what I've already done, is these rotors that we put on here, these are Toyota rotors, and we have these brake calipers here that they are oversized, significantly oversized compared to the factory ones. Um, basically, um, we can, it's a direct bolt-on kit because the whole thing here basically bolts onto the factory mounting points just as normal. And then I've also done a um, hydraulic line brake up upgrade. So uh, it's using the steel braided brake lines um, so you get more braking force from that manner. Um, let me show you some of the, the brake lines that we got going on here. We're using these crown brake lines, steel braided brake lines. These things are made in the USA and they are a perfect fit for this truck. Uh, a few things. To do the upgrade, we have to modify the brake caliper. Now what I do is, is I take the brake caliper to a machine shop, the uh, caliper basically machined, and then it basically removes 5 30 seconds of a material. Because if you don't do this uh, upgrade or have it machined, um, there's going to be interference with the brake caliper and the, uh, the rotor. So I'll show you right here where we take that material off of. So I've already taken this to the machine shop, and you can see this little line right there. Now that guy right there is right where, where it's shiny, is where I had them take off about 5 30 seconds of material. Now you can do this by hand, you can use a grinder, you can use other things, you can cut it down. Um, I prefer to have it kind of more of a machined, perfectly flat surface because this is a brake caliper. This is, um, this is a kind of an important component and shaving off too much material or having the material not lined up properly can cause issues with the rotor possibly t making contact, um, corrosion getting in between here, excessive debris, misalignment, uh, all sorts of stuff can happen from it. So, take off 530 seconds of material from here, take it to an um, automotive machine shops typically are not capable of doing this. You might have to go to a actual a tooling or a precision uh, machine shop, one that just like is a general machining. Those are the best places usually to go to because then this isn't a normal component that they machine. They're like, hey, you bring a cow, they're used to doing cylinder heads in machine shops or engine blocks or whatever. They don't do calipers, you know, that's not something they do, that's not normal. So take your calipers to a machine shop, have them milled down 530 seconds and then it's perfect alignment. Then basically all you gotta do is bolt these things on, slap in the brake pads, slap on the new Toyota rotors. Um, the GX460 ones, they are about two inches taller and they're wider, thicker in diameter and stuff. Like it's just an all around way better upgrade. So just wanted to give you a little rundown on that and just see what's going on and yeah, if you ever uh, are experiencing some braking issues on your um, Toyota Sequoia, this also works on first gen Toyota Tundras as well. And if you know anything about Toyotas, the Tundra calipers fit onto first gen Tacomas and third gen Forerunners. You just have to trim the backing plates on those guys, 13 WL calipers. Now, if you want to go, so common people will do the Tacoma upgrade or the Tundra upgrade onto Tacomas. Now, you want to go bigger brake calipers on a Tacoma or a third gen Forerunner, do the GX460 one. It's going to bolt directly on. All you got to do is just have that machined off 530 seconds and bam, you have significantly better brakes all around, bigger rotors, bigger calipers, bigger brake pads. Like what more could you want? So just giving you a little update, rundown on that. So uh, hope you guys have uh, enjoyed the video and uh, I'll talk to you later. Bye.